Have you ever had dreams where you saw the earth engulfed in fire? Or where you saw floods sweeping across cities? Have you ever wondered that a situation like the movie 2012 could really arise? Today, we're diving into a topic that's both fascinating and a little frightening. The potential ways life on Earth might end. It's a sobering subject, but also an incredible opportunity to explore the delicate balance that keeps our world alive and thriving. While we'd all like to think that life on Earth will carry on forever, the truth is that our planet and life itself is vulnerable to a range of threats. In this video, we're going to explore several major factors that scientists believe could bring an end to life as we know it. From resource abuse and climate change to catastrophic asteroid impacts and the eventual death of our sun, we'll look at the mechanisms and events that could spell the end for life on Earth. So, grab a cup of coffee, and let's dive into the unsettling yet intriguing future of our planet. Human-caused threats. Number one on the list of human-caused threats is resource abuse. This is something that's all too familiar, the depletion of our planet's natural resources. The story of human impact on Earth is, in many ways, a story of resource abuse. Humans have spent thousands of years extracting minerals, fossil fuels, and water from the Earth at an accelerating pace. Every tree we cut down, every drop of water we pump, and every piece of land we build on reduces Earth's natural resources. But why is this a problem? When we overuse resources like water, soil, and fossil fuels, we disrupt natural systems that are essential for sustaining life. Deforestation, for example, reduces the amount of oxygen-producing trees, which is critical for keeping our atmosphere balanced. Overusing water leads to scarcity and disrupts agricultural systems, making it harder to grow food. Eventually, if resource abuse continues at this rate, Earth could become an inhospitable place. This could lead to mass starvation, biodiversity collapse, and extreme competition for the remaining resources. While this might not completely wipe out life on Earth, it could make the planet unlivable for humans and many other species. Number two, climate change. Hand in hand with resource abuse is climate change. We've all heard about it, but why is it considered one of the top existential threats to life on Earth? As we burn fossil fuels for energy, we release greenhouse gases, like carbon dioxide and methane, into the atmosphere. These gases trap heat from the sun, creating a greenhouse effect that warms the planet. Over time, this warming leads to a cascade of effects, rising sea levels, melting ice caps, extreme weather events, droughts, and changes in ecosystems. If climate change continues unchecked, it could make parts of Earth uninhabitable. Scientists warn that runaway climate change could lead to a hothouse Earth scenario, where temperatures rise to levels that are fatal for most life forms. In such a world, the survival of humans and other species would be unlikely. Number three nuclear warfare and biological threats. Another human-caused risk is nuclear warfare. While it may seem like a relic of the Cold War era, the threat of nuclear conflict still looms. A large-scale nuclear war could cause widespread destruction, but there's another consequence called nuclear winter. In a nuclear winter scenario, smoke and soot from firestorms would rise into the atmosphere, blocking out sunlight for months or even years. This would lead to freezing temperatures, failed crops, and mass starvation on a global scale. Similarly, we face biological threats, both natural and man-made. Scientists have warned about the dangers of pandemics caused by highly infectious diseases. The COVID-19 pandemic showed us how disruptive a virus can be, but it was relatively mild compared to what a highly lethal airborne disease could do. Such a pandemic could decimate human populations and destabilize society in unimaginable ways natural disasters. Number one, forest fires, floods, and tsunamis. Natural disasters like forest fires, floods, and tsunamis pose serious risks to life on Earth. Forest fires, often exacerbated by hotter and drier climates, can devastate vast areas of forest, destroying habitats and releasing massive amounts of carbon dioxide, further accelerating climate change. Floods, intensified by rising sea levels and extreme weather, can lead to massive loss of life, destruction of infrastructure, and displacement of communities. Similarly, tsunamis caused by underwater earthquakes or volcanic eruptions can send walls of water crashing onto coastlines with catastrophic impact, washing away entire towns, ecosystems, and even reshaping landscapes. These disasters, while individually localized, contribute to larger global effects, pushing ecosystems and societies closer to the brink of collapse if they occur frequently or in combination with other factors. Number two, supervolcanic eruptions. 
Another natural disaster that could end life on Earth is a supervolcanic eruption. Unlike regular volcanic eruptions, supervolcanoes release massive amounts of magma, ash, and gases into the atmosphere. One of the most famous supervolcanoes is Yellowstone, located in the United States. If it were to erupt, it would eject ash across much of North America, disrupt global climate, and could even trigger a volcanic winter. The ash in the atmosphere would block sunlight, dropping temperatures worldwide, similar to the effect of an asteroid impact. Crops would fail, ecosystems would collapse, and life would struggle to survive in a colder, darker world. Long-term cosmic threats. Number one, the dying sun. Moving from geological time to astronomical time, let's talk about one of the most definitive ways life on Earth will end, the death of our sun. Our sun is a stable middle-aged star, but like all stars, it has a life cycle. In about five billion years, the sun will exhaust all of its hydrogen fuel and begin to expand into a red giant. When this happens, it will engulf the inner planets, including Earth, long before it physically reaches us. Though, the increasing heat will boil away our oceans, strip away the atmosphere, and make life on Earth impossible. Even if humans are around billions of years from now, Earth will no longer be habitable because of our dying sun. This transformation is inevitable, and it's a stark reminder that our planet's fate is ultimately tied to the life cycle of our star. Number two, cosmic radiation and supernovae. Another cosmic threat comes from the universe itself, cosmic radiation and supernova explosions. Our galaxy, the Milky Way, is filled with stars at various stages of their lives, and some of them end in supernovae massive explosions that release deadly gamma radiation. If a supernova occurs close enough to Earth, the resulting gamma ray burst could strip away our atmosphere's protective ozone layer, leaving life exposed to deadly ultraviolet radiation from the sun. This could cause widespread extinction, as life would struggle to survive the increased radiation levels. Although supernovae close enough to impact Earth are rare, it's a possibility that cannot be entirely ruled out. Number 3. Asteroid Impacts Earth has been hit by small asteroids before, and it will keep happening again and again. The most famous asteroid impact happened about 66 million years ago and is believed to have led to the extinction of the dinosaurs. That asteroid, estimated to be about 10 kilometers wide, released an immense amount of energy, causing fires, tsunamis and sending dust into the atmosphere that blocked sunlight for years. If a similar sized asteroid hit today, the effects would be catastrophic. Millions would die just at the point of impact and the dust arising from the impact would block sunlight causing a nuclear winter-like effect, disrupting agriculture, and leading to widespread starvation. The good news, scientists are actively working to track potentially hazardous asteroids. However, even with tracking, we might not have the technology to prevent a collision, especially if we don't detect it early enough. The fate of life itself. Lastly, there's the question of the universe itself. Scientists are still trying to understand the ultimate fate of the universe. Some theories suggest that the universe might continue expanding forever, but others predict scenarios like the Big Rip, where the expansion of the universe accelerates until it tears apart galaxies, stars, and even atoms. If this happens, life as we know it wouldn't just end on Earth, it would cease to exist anywhere. However, this is purely speculative, and if it does happen, it's likely billions or even trillions of years away. Nonetheless, it's a humbling reminder that even on the grandest scale, life has an expiration date. So there you have it, a glimpse into the potential ways life on Earth might come to an end. While some of these scenarios like climate change and resource abuse are issues we can actively work on, others like supervolcanic eruptions or the death of our sun are simply part of the natural cycle of the universe. It's sobering to think that our planet and all the life on it are subject to forces far beyond our control. However, understanding these threats is essential. Not only does it help us appreciate the fragility of our existence, but it also underscores the importance of taking care of our planet while we're here. Thank you for watching. If you found this video interesting, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel for more explorations into the wonders and mysteries of our world and beyond. And let us know in the comments which potential threat surprised you the most.